Hi guys, it is Kathleen and I'm back to do my highly requested nail shaping video. So here as you can see, my nails are grown as normal, like naturally, and they are round. And so I told you before that three of my nails grow round and then two grow squared, super weird. But here I have a regular nail file, you can buy this anywhere, I got mine at Sally's for dollar something I think maybe less so what I do first is I start on one side of my nail so I'm going to reduce the length of that one side of my nail by going one way this is how I find my nails by going one way I don't do that back and forth stuff I just go one way and then I leave like a tip in the middle and then I do the other side so here I'm doing the other side and then I go straight across to get that even squared out line. It's really hard to explain, but I think you kind of get the gist. And then I turn my nail around, and here I do go like up and down to get like that um, really firm square. And then I file like the sides a little bit, but not always. And then that's really what I do, you know, as to like filing and reducing length because when you when you file your nails you're you're bound to like take length off which is why I let mine grow to a certain length and then I just file them because I know I don't want to leave them too short after I file them so for my other nails that are just naturally squared out I just give them like a more deeper nicer square like even out square so once I'm done with that file, you see like that residue that you get when you file your nails? I have it on one of my nails right now that you can see. To get rid of that, I use a glass file. A glass file is the best thing ever. It leaves you, it gives you like that final polished filed nail that everyone wants. It is awesome. I Trust me, it's really hard to explain what it does, but once you like buy it, it's really not that expensive. I got it on Amazon, super cheap. Just type in glass file. Um, but it gives you like that final po final polished look. Trust me, it does it does wonders. And so I just finish it off with this glass file. And then I'm set. Like my nails are perfectly squared the way I want it. And if you want your nails like oval, you can definitely use a glass file to do that. Because a glass file immediately takes off like... I don't know, it's so hard to explain, but it is awesome. So here I'm doing my thumb. So I'm doing one side, and then I'm about to show you the tip that I'm talking about that I that I leave. You see that right there? So I've I've cut down one side, I filed down one side, and then I go to the other side of my nail to even out the file, and then I go straight across on top. So you see that like diamond shape? Yeah, I'm left with that. And so then this is when I go straight across to file out my nail like evenly on top and get that nice squared look. So this is what my nails look like once I have filed them and I'm done filing them. So now what I use, I bought this Burt's Bees, I love Burt's Bees. And this is lemon butter cuticle cream. Let me tell you, this stuff is so cool. It's like a, bl a smoothing blend of natural ingredients to nourish weak nails and soften dry cuticles. Massage cream into and around the nails. First of all, I love the smell of lemon. And it leaves your nails, and I put it on my hands, like a baby's butt. It is so soft. This stuff is really cool. I have only used it twice, and so far I love it. So I'm going to give it, you know, a couple more weeks before I say it's like the best thing ever. But I found that these past two times that I've used it, it's like like a replacement for the um, mango the mango cuticle oil that I use you know this is just faster because for the oil you have to let the oil dry and this immediately dries and it leaves your nails so soft it is mm. so I'm just gonna try it out for a couple more times and then I can tell you how I really really feel about it anyways so once that is done I just go ahead and apply my base coat this is Nail Magic. I'm actually running out, so I need to go get a new one because I love this stuff. This is this is the stuff that I use to, you know, every time that I paint my nails. This is in my video on how to 
prepare for a manicure. And here are my nails. They have been shaped nice and squared and so pretty. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and that you please subscribe and share with others and that it was detailed enough so that you guys are able to understand. So I will catch you guys in my next video and thanks so much for watching. Bye guys!